Hi everyone and welcome back to this, the fourth developer diary for the Prince of Persia, The Two Thrones. Last time we focused on the animation and the AI. This time we're going to talk about the freeform fighting system and the all new spectacular speed kill system. In Prince of Persia, The Two Thrones, the prince has returned to Babylon, his hometown. He finds that it's ravaged by war, under siege by an enemy army who are hunting him. He's a fugitive in his own town. He must adapt to the situation, developing new techniques to take his enemies down, like the all-new speed kill system. So there's a whole uh, acrobatic approach to the opponent where you have to find your way uh, on the rooftops, on the, uh, on the walls, etc. to progress through the city and go to, a, to an enemy and then surprise him. But there's also a strategic aspect to the speed kill system. In a lot of situations, the player will have to think before he acts, analyze the situation, and then perform the speed kill. Enemies can cover each other, uh, guards patrolling, uh, seeing each other, so you cannot attack a guard when another one is seeing it. We also have what we call the sand gate, uh, which is basically an alarm system. When the prince comes close to a sand gate, he will notice that there's guards and a special guard, the sand gate guard, who has the ability to trigger the sand gate and call in reinforcements. If you fail a speed kill, uh, the result will be that you will enter a fight. And uh, throughout the game, you can choose whether you want to go more of a fighting uh, strategy or more of a speed kill strategy and approach any situation the way you'd like. In order to defeat your enemies, you'll be able to use the speed kill system, but we've also brought back the freeform fighting system for the Prince, plus added an all new hand-to-hand -hand combat style for the Dark Prince. The Dark Prince uses the Dagger of Time and the Dagger Tail, which is a long uh, chain that he uses like a whip in order to attack his enemies. And he's also able uh, to use the Dagger Tail as a shield. Uh, by rotating it very fast, he keeps enemies at bay and he's then able to perform special finishing moves, a horizontal slash and a vertical slash. He's also able uh, to grab his enemies and uh, attract them to him and then perform a killing blow. The Dark Prince is also able to use the environment to his advantage. For example, he can grab a column with the dagger tail and rotate around it, uh, killing everyone in between himself and the column. We've just presented to you the all-new speed kill system and the all-new freeform fighting system. There's more in store, so stay tuned next time for the fifth installment of the Developer Diaries for Prince of Persia, The Two Thrones.